Terima kasih juga kepada seluruh rakyat Beta yang telah hidup dengan penuh kerukunan dan aman dan damai serta terus gagah menghadapi pelbagai gelora pandemik, kemurungan ekonomi dan kemulut politik yang melanda tanah air. The five-year reign of the 16th Yang Di-Pertuan Agong, Al-Sultan Abdullah Sultan Ahmad Shah, has been one of devoted service founded on an unyielding sense of duty and honor. Over the term of his office, the king won the hearts of all Malaysians by showing the royal institution to be the protector of democracy, a pillar of peace, and the heart of unity. With political turmoil occurring amidst the COVID-19 pandemic, Al-Sultan Abdullah, through his undoubted wisdom and in consultation with the Conference of Rulers, astutely resolved multiple issues affecting the country through negotiations with political leaders. Four different prime ministers served during his tenure. Al-Sultan Abdullah ascended the throne in January 2019 when Dr. Mahathir Mohamad was prime minister. He later appointed Muhyiddin Yassin and Ismail Sabri Yaakob. Ismail Sabri bin Yaakob as the country's eighth and ninth prime ministers. Following the 15th general election in November 2022, the country witnessed its first ever hung parliament. To resolve the impasse, Al Sultan Abdullah proposed the formation of a unity government led by current Prime Minister Anwar Ibrahim. Saya Anwar bin Ibrahim setelah dilantik memegang jawatan seorang Perdana Menteri. Al Sultan Abdullah and Raja Permaisuri Agung Tunku Azizah Amina Maimuna Iskandaria have been a constant source of strength and reassurance, feeling the sorrows of the rakyat and sharing in their joys. Over 11 days last September, the royal couple made people of every age, race and religion in Sabah and Sarawak feel as one with Peninsula Malaysians. Undertaking a punishing 2,154-kilometre road journey across the two East Malaysian states, they sang, danced and mingled with the locals, fostering a feeling of togetherness. The song Setia Perpaduan, the theme song of the National Unity Week celebration in May last year, was a brainchild of Al Sultan Abdullah. In December, the King and Queen lit up sports flame a celebration with some 200 sporting legends and guests in Kuala Lumpur in an event that showcased Malaysia's unity in diversity. Al Sultan Abdullah also endeared himself to many by taking on the mantle of carer in chief, making numerous impromptu visits to flood hit and disaster areas, even going to the aid of road crash victims. Thank you, Your Majesties, for serving us with grace, humility, and resilience, and for making us feel patriotic. Farewell. To love somebody, to love all of you.